We're gonna make this dry shrinking as simple as possible today. We have dry shrink prep underneath here. We have Pro Classic. We have trimmed the film just a little bit wider than my side border here. And it's about an inch longer at the bottom, about an inch longer at the top. Find the center point of your film. Cart it straight so you have basically an even amount of film on the bottom and an even amount of film on the top. Doesn't have to be perfect. Then take the very edge of that felt card and smooth out that edge. Same thing with the side here. What you're just trying to do is get bunches of your film to go in this direction. Once you do that, turn on a heat gun, get a Wagner one, turn it all the way to high, and then we're gonna make single passes very close to the film. So we're gonna do this, pull up, and then bring it back over and just go over straight again. So once you hit that point that needs to be shrunk, don't even think about it. Just keep going. Keep the heat gun moving at a nice consistent speed throughout. Don't even look at the film. Just keep that distance and that speed the same. Go throughout the entire window. So some areas are not shrinking as much as I need them to, but just keep going. Get all the way to the bottom and then stop, reach underneath the film and tug it straight down. Go about halfway. Now take your felt card and just smooth out the film till it starts bunching back up and you start noticing these little peaks. Those are gonna be the next areas that you have to shrink. But once you start hitting those, reach back under the film again and pull and let some air back in those spaces. Again, halfway. Now you're gonna do the same thing with the heat gun. Hold it about just this close, keep it moving. When you start getting closer to the bottom, Sometimes you're gonna to have to slow down your speed a little bit too, so you make slower passes with the same distance. And now look. That's completely shrunk. Find that center point, smooth it out, lightly card down that edge, and then same thing, heat gun, close to the film and just keep it moving fast. You're basically guessing through this entire process. But if you just kind of shut your brain off and go through the motions, this works out really well. The real secret here is you're shrinking the film an even amount pretty much across the entire back window. And then that pull is gonna help shoot some air underneath, loosen it up. So then when you smooth this out, it's not gonna bind up or anything. So push it. Until it starts bunching up again. And it's after you get to that point, shoot some air underneath it again, pull it, loosen it back up, and then make that pass again. And if you need to slow it down, just go a tad bit slower hit it for a little bit longer, but never just stop in one place for too long because that heat gun is so close. And again, release it, put some air underneath, and then start carting it down and see what bunches up. 
And then you can hit those areas with some more heat. And you're done. Same thing with the top. Pull it. Just make sure you loosen it up from the glass first. And then start it a little low and just work your way into it. You're going up about an inch every time you move. Just keep it very close to the glass. Keep it nice and consistent. All the way. Once you do that, pull your film. Lightly card it. Once you see those peaks, you want to stop. Again, pull some air back underneath it. Just loosen up that area that started peaking. Make sure that side's tacked down, heat gun. So every time you do that, it's good to just pull some air back underneath the film, loosen it up. That'll prevent it from binding. Let's move that back out. We're past where we need to shrink, but if you wanted to, hit that with a little more heat. And you're done. Last corner, just so you guys can see how ridiculously foolproof this seems to be. Um, loosen it up. Heat gun real close. Cross till you get to the halfway point. to the end, pull it again. Just straighten those out, pull some air under what you can. Take your card, give it like firm pressure when you do this. Just be careful of how high you go up till it starts bunching up. So you see these corners, when it starts doing that, you can just smooth that out in this direction and then that swoop will turn into this bunch up right here. So pull it straight, hit it with some heat. After you do that, pull it again, card it down. Last little stretch here. The bunched up areas take the most amount of heat. So if you move a little slower in those areas, that's fine. There you go. That's it.